trip this time around. So I'm heading to the south coast to pick up my old man and he's gonna jump in the car with me and we're going exploring. So we're on the hunt for campsites. I'm not gonna tell you where they are. <laughs> I've got a couple of ideas for adventures. So dad knows of a few bits and pieces of old mining equipment and some old mines. And there's one mine that I know about that's bloody deep and still wide open and I've made up a rig where I'm gonna send a camera and a light down on a fishing rod. Well, we're out here. We just got in the bush and we're gonna head down, but straight away, you just go bang. Bloody logging these amazing forests that just got smashed by fires. They should be leaving it alone in my opinion, but anyway, we're blocked. Open the road, you dogs. Check in, it's mandatory. Old man's with me. We're in the bush at least. You can hear, you can hear the machines chopping down gum trees, natives. Anyway, it's time to air down and we'll keep on moving. Wouldn't believe we just bloody pulled up, had a big whinge about the gate being shut and then um, forestry bloke turns up and said he'd let us through. Fucking legend. <laughs> Anyway, we're going through now, past the machinery up here, I suppose. Thanks, mate. I'll do the old drive-off trick. Gotta love this. Oi! <laughs> Found mine that we've never seen before. New mines, you beauty. What's that say? What's it say? Band of mine workings entering this area may cause injury, serious injury or death. Ooh. So There's a bit of tin right there. Yeah, I'll we'll see how deep it is. Chuck something down. Let's see. There's another one just there. They're everywhere. No, it's stop straight away. There. There's one over here. Oh, that's just, that's just there. Mm, goes for a little bit. Looks like it goes off to the side, but oh yeah, look, it does. Anyway, let's go mine fishing. We're getting close. We're about two minutes away from the uh, the big open one that we went to in our last trip in this area, and uh, we're going to send a camera and a light down it. Material. Leech, leech session. This is uh oh oh <laughs> it looks like these are two creeks joining up just down here. I'd like to throw it if it is. <clears throat> Look out for leeches. Oh yeah, this is pretty is cool. Yeah. Look this one. Two creeks. This is so pristine, isn't it? <laughs> you okay? Oh, 
<laughs> oh, your ribs, your ribs are all right. Yeah, Be careful. <laughs> Jesus. Oh. Yeah, okay? Somehow I bent my finger, but. Around the corner. I can hear water big. Oh, it's beautiful. I can hear a little waterfall through there. If there's the car, you're going through there. It's going to be leech. I was mainly scared of getting wet. <laughs> I actually captured some of the fall, end of the fall. Definitely got all the audio. That's definitely going on YouTube. Tree branch now. Yeah, and you go ah. <laughs> all right, let's go quick, fast ah. without leeches. This this vine's got prickles on it. Okay, go. Just don't do an ankle. Oh yeah, it does too. Nasty one. We made it. Ah. Semi injured, a little bit injured. square isn't it Imagine. it's fucking it's not bad it's not bad you can see the bottom but, uh, this is it mine rig this is my mine fishing rig got a light and an old gopro bobby miko if you're watching that's your old shop gopro ah uh, yeah it's going down the mine prepared to lose it if, we, if it fails, if we don't know what footage we're gonna get, who knows what's down there. I just wanna see what's down there. So I'll extend this fishing rod, send it down and see what happens, huh? We've gotta remember where it is. I'm gonna just guess here, which the path of least resistance. Much danger, much danger. Here, throw a rock down. Here. Yeah, this one's crazy, ready? Water. GoPro on. What do you reckon? That mid, medium, medium brightness. No, well, that's all right. Don't know if it's spinning or definitely bouncing a bit. What will happen if I hit the bottom? I just, what if I, I don't well, want to submerge the just camera. Pump, yeah, don't, yeah. Oh, I'm going to stop for a bit. It's swaying a bit. <laughs> Not much. It's a bit. What it's bouncing too? It's definitely swaying at like, least a f three or four hundred mil sideways. That's better. If you fell in there, you'd be dead for sure. How far down should I go? You reckon there's water? Sounded like there was. 
Don't you reckon? Oh, I think it looks like it. I'm coming up. Come back and come up here. It's getting a bit stressful. I feel like it's snagged on something. Surely it's not that far away, like. Yeah, there it is, just there. Three metres down. Fuck, don't do it again, it's too dangerous. Here it comes. Oh my God, that's stressful as. No, it's just, just stressful, Beanie. There's holes Eight all over. There's holes all over the joint, eh? It's not even uh, wet. Uh, I didn't go to the bottom, that's Oh, it, don't. All right, let's go back, have a look at the footage. If it's good, put it in the video. If it's shit, we'll probably still put it in the video. Don't have a waterproof camera. It doesn't have the waterproof back on it. So I'm too scared and it's freaking so much tension on the rod. I don't know if the line's strong enough. Good mission, let's have a look. Oh, oh. What? <laughs> look at it. That's perfectly square, isn't it? Far out. What's that? Dust or something. Water? No. Yes! It's, fucking, it's not bad, it's not bad, you can see the bottom. I'm bloody pretty happy with that. Alright, so mine fishing's done. I reckon that was a success. Now we're going just campsite hunting and exploring. There's a heap of spots that uh, head down to rivers and creeks and shit and we're just going to follow maps and see what we find. Hopefully we get a couple of good campsites. And um, I got one, my eye on one for tonight, so sorted for tonight. Jesus, this is real tight. Oh, it's nice and open. The sun's getting in now, I've got no tire trucks in here. The soil, what's that soil? Rubbish, burn it, bury it, or take it home. Leave yeah. the bush better than you found it. That is 100% true. Oh, that's you, flowing, isn't it, dude? I reckon you could drink that easy, just yeah. straight out of there. Bloody hell, would you believe it? We are exploring and we're at an amazing spot, creek crossing and hey presto. So stopper. Oh, it's only just here. Yeah, but look how long it is. Yeah, but can we get around it? We can just, you could almost cut some of that. Yeah, let's do that. There goes our petrol I've got another extra little bit. There's, there's plenty. This is an amazing spot.
kicked the eggs out of the oh, track. We won't get up there. What are we looking at deep it is? I wouldn't even... Would you get up there? I don't really know. I reckon it's... There's a, no, there's a ledge before it, a metre out from the base of it on that side. You'd have to go on that side. There's a ledge in there. Mighty Zito strikes again. We're going to get around that, and then there's a big step, sort of like a double step. Nervous. Oh yeah, gnarly as shit I've done in a little while. Sweating like a pig. The old man's loving life. Shitting, Shitting himself. <laughs> All right, now I need to move shit in the car. You couldn't go back, could you? <sighs> nah, the tail hitch got, I couldn't go backwards. That's what's gonna, what's gonna stop that when we go back. You got insurance for all this, haven't you? <laughs> yes. Oh man, that was full on, that was intense. Got it sorted, but how'd you feel? Oh, I check my underpants. I wasn't even, I just wouldn't even. Sort of shit. No, no I didn't really. I'm worried there'll be no one has come to Oh, well, here. there's potential for. So yeah, it's so over. There's potential for a showstopper at this end too. But we shouldn't be that far. Doesn't look too bad. Yeah. Oh, yeah that, someone's Laughing. used this track. You must be able to come in the other way. Yeah, I wouldn't have gone one way to have to turn around. No way. Um, yeah, we'll be up the top in a minute. And then we're finding somewhere to have a coffee and a break. That was... Fuck me. Bit of a tributary. Coming into the creek. Here comes the madman into Colorado. <laughs> Oh, yes. 
Does you know where this track goes? Yeah, it's on the maps. It joins to other ones. It might, if we have to turn around then whatever. Limp mode. What? That's never happened before. What is it? It just turned off. Yeah. Well, I think we're fucked here. This is bad. Pretty confident there's something going on with the fuel pump because it's making a horrible noise when you prime it, when you turn it on. So I've never heard it make noises like that. Um, yeah, we're gonna try and go and get phone reception and see if we can get out of here. Made some phone calls, got on to me mate Wayno. mate I owe you so much, thank you, he's coming out. Hopefully we can tow the car back onto this main road and then tow truck can come out tomorrow, drop us off at a mechanic, get it sorted out during the week and figure it out, eh? But he'll have a winch, mate. He should probably. He's got to turn around, buddy. You'd be coming from the bay. Wayne out of the rescue. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're going straight down this hill. Full steam. It's going to compress the suspension a bit, but straight through that. So I needed. I'll just come right. And just yeah, start just turning when I'm. That. Yeah, all I'm that big rock. Get as far up there as possible. All right. Don't stand in front of the camera. <laughs> you don't stand there. Either. No, I'm gonna go. I, I don't want to go. Good on you. Yeah, all right. All right up there. All right. Here he comes. Ooh, he's fucking flying. Shit. <laughs> Hit the brakes! <laughs> Get it! Well done! Punched it! Punched it! Wayno's towing me back to reception and we're gonna camp here the night, tow truck coming tomorrow. That's the plan anyway, we'll see what happens. We're done, we're up here. Quick tour of camp, main road. Mountains out there, main road. Campsite. After that day, it's like beers. <laughs> Got him! This is like paradise. Well, yeah, this is like paradise. I mean, it is. After today. Tow truck sorted. I'm lined yeah, up for the yeah. tow truck. He'll just park up there somewhere and winch me on. And Nice chair, by the way. 
Where'd you get that from? I found it in the... I'm saying I found it where the forestry guides were, they left it there. Or someone else might have dumped it there, I don't know. I might get you a good one for Christmas. Actually... I'm going to fix this one. <laughs> You're going to fix that one? All that crap, just put a strengthener across there. <laughs> just like it. So that is a beauty how it folds. Oh, right? yeah, it just cracked then. This one's bloody good. Bag bowl for dinner now. That old cod, I want to melt that. We only got Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Right, that's probably ready. So, the man doesn't take long, mate. I hate just reheating it. What do you do? Put it back in a bowl. Yeah. You want a bowl? A plate. Yeah, a bowl or a, or a plate, whatever you've got. Ah, shit, that's hot. Very good. Spag bowl on the yeah, fire, reheated. Bowl yep, I'll bring around. it down. I'll bring it. Not too hot, bloody good. And you hope the stick doesn't break. Listen to it. Stop the end of the fuel pump. Is it a full tank? It's pretty. It was pretty steep. It might have gone past the parameter. Listen to it. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it sounds stopped. crook. It sounds like a bloody. It stops. Yeah, but it's, it sounds like it's dry, like there's no fuel in it. Yeah. Oh, well, it's the morning after, pissed down rain and it was windy, it's windy and gusts. Crazy morning anyway, tow truck, croakers towing or something are coming from the bay. Collie's still sitting here, it's not throwing an error code, I've done the scan, so pff, the old soft shackle got a flogging yesterday, it's a bit damaged in there, and all the other straps. We're on, we're on the truck. So this bloke, Jason Smith, tow truck was a champion. And staying here until she's fixed. Well, we are home, back at Dad's. Car is down at the bay, at the mechanics. Hopefully get diagnosed next week. Epic trip. <laughs> Solo is intense. Going solo, one car, very intense. Let me know if you like this video because pff, first time I've done anything like that. I hope it turned out all right. Anyway, catch you next time. All right, very quickly, we got the car back. It was a super simple fix. 
Uh, a little bit disappointed that I didn't find it myself, but at the time when we got the car back up onto the main dirt road, I was just ready to have a few beers and sit down around the fire. We're <laughs> done for the day. Um, had I had a good look, I probably could have find, found the issue, but anyway, let's get under and um, I'll show you. All right, under the car. I was looking up in here, because there's the fuel pump, and that's what was making all the noise. But the problem was, at the front here, so this fuel line here goes up, up here, and into the fuel filters. So I didn't look at all up there, and you can just see there's a mark there. So apparently that was pushed right deep in up there behind the fuel filter and crimping. That's what caused the issue. So I think a stick's come in, maybe in this way, hit the fuel tank and then speared back that way in there and pushed it up in. You can see sort of marks on that barb thing. As simple as that. That's where the fuel line was crimped.